Hi everyone, this is the fifth episode of Digital Marketing Series and it is about 12 on-page SEO techniques. I am presenting each of these techniques as individual videos. Um, the second of the 12 techniques is about meta description. I'm going to discuss in, the, in this video what this is a, what is a meta description and how to write a powerful and effective meta description. Meta descriptions are brief description of what the website or web page is all about. On search results, they will appear below the title text as you, see, as you have seen in my earlier episode. Um, meta descriptions today are not known to have any weight on you know, ranking your web pages. Uh, in fact, Google, Bing and other search engines have stopped using meta descriptions in their ranking algorithms years ago. Um, but that's not to say meta descriptions are not important. Right? They are still important in the sense that when people uh, arrive on the search results and they read, they, they, let's say they look at your title and they like your title and they start to read the meta description. So this becomes like uh, ad copy, you know, it's, it's, for you, it's an opportunity for you to convince these people who are now looking at your meta description to click on your link. And when they click on your link, now, that is a direct SEO ranking factor. So how to write powerful and effective meta description? One of the ways would be to use benefit-driven copy. Write compelling copy to increase the number of people clicking through that link to your website. And you do it by describing the benefit that they will get when they go to your web page. Yeah, and what benefit they will get from that web page. Position all the content in terms of the benefits for the user and put it all this in all this most important information at the first part or the beginning part of your meta description copy. Every meta description needs to quickly communicate the subject matter. Right, that ties in with the title tag. But more importantly, you should also quickly communicate the benefit that they will get when they land on your web page. If the web page is for a specific product, brand or topic, put those terms and keywords at the beginning. Here's an important tip. Meta descriptions are excellent to have call to action. You can include the call to action into the meta description. And one of the ways is to ask questions to entice searchers to click on the link to your website. The call to action can also be things like, you know, find out more, buy now, uh, go to the shop or, or shop here, you know. But Remember, don't be too aggressive with your copy. Here's a tip that's quite obvious, but I need, it needs to be said, yeah? All right. Remember to do your best to make the meta description consistent and relevant to the title tag. Every page needs its own unique meta description, right? So please do not have duplicate meta description on, you know, uh, that's similar to other pages on your website. Uh, make sure that the meta description for every page is unique and interesting. Google has recently recommended that people write unique meta descriptions. This is versus auto-generating them. There are some apps that can auto-generate meta description. So try not to use those. Try to write your own unique meta descriptions. Remember to write naturally. 
Yeah, make your meta description conversational. Remember, you are writing for people. After all, people are the ones reading your link and meta description. So don't write for search engines or or, or algorithms. Natural language communicates better. Meta descriptions should have less than 160 characters. So write wisely, write naturally, you know, uh, otherwise your description could get cut off or Google may not even use your description at all. Google has, has been known to actually pick another part of your content and use that for the meta description because they, you know, they, they feel that maybe that is more relevant to the, you know, the search results or the search query. Do you have any questions about meta descriptions? Let me know in the comments below. In my next video, I will share about another SE, uh, on-page SEO technique, and that is headings. Remember to subscribe and hit the notification button to get updated whenever I publish a new video. I wish you immense wealth and success.